Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar and this is another episode from the Amazon review series. In the box right here, as you can see, we'll go ahead and open it up, see what it is. All right guys, so here we go. Um, as you can see, this is a site and this is by Hiram. Now Hiram does happen to be a subsidiary of Penty. And uh, with this, as you can see, it does come uh, with a few accessories. Uh, one of the first things I noticed, of course, here is it does have uh, the little rubber, uh, basically, lens covers. Uh, with it, it does come with a riser, uh, and this is a solid piece riser that uh, does go on, I believe this will go on both a pick and a weaver style rail. Now, it also comes with a second uh, riser set here, and uh, this one it does have the rail there and then it has the uh, locking mechanism here that uses uh, the two screws which uh, it does, they do give you the little wrench there to tighten and untighten that. Nice thing about this one is that it does have these openings on the side um, which are for the M-lock system uh, which is basically just another way to attach things so you can actually add things on the side here. Um, one thing I will say about uh, having these and having especially like the opening like this is that um, if I want to set up and have uh, a set of hard sights, they can be seen straight through the opening here. On the other side of that, I can take this and uh, use the lower one here and mount it directly flat to the uh, uh, basically, you know, somewhere on the barrel or the back end of the gun there. Now, of course, in general, sights like this, because there isn't any kind of magnification at all and because of uh, the dotting and everything the red dot it's good for anywhere from close range to what I would consider mid distances you probably generally wouldn't want to go too much more than a hundred yards with this just for the fact that uh, you know then the dot uh, may end up becoming in relation to how small the target is getting to look from being so far away the dot may be a little overpowering and kind of oversized and so getting that accuracy kind of diminishes with that uh, extended range. Uh, now this on it as you can see does have your different adjustments and uh, you've got your windage and elevation knobs here. You also have uh, the two little buttons here and these two little buttons are for both uh, red and it actually does have a green dot as well and uh, so we can sit there and change which one and it does have different brightnesses. Uh, this also has the battery case right here on the side which is really nice that they also included a battery. Alright so got that in there and just checking it out I'm just looking down through it I hit the uh, button and uh, the button at the back here is for the red dot the button in the front then turns it to a green dot uh, and then also as you go you press the button, the more you press the button, the brighter it gets. I've got three, four, five, six, seven, and then it's off. Uh, now you can see at the front here probably a little bit, uh, this is silvered and of course that's how a reflex sight works is a half silvered mirror basically. Let's go ahead and get this in there and uh, kind of see what it looks like when it's on the gun. So what you want to do is you want to make sure you loosen this up enough so that this is going to get wide enough that this can drop down over top of the sides of the rail system here. Now this is ready to be used. We can make our adjustments with the windage and elevation knobs, set this up to whatever distance we want. If you guys want to check this out, of course, go ahead down there in the description below. There will be a link to this on the Amazon site. Of course, there's going to be the social media down there, the PayPal link, which takes place of Patreon. And uh, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button on the way down or on your way back up, as well as that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And that little bell, don't forget to ring it so you know when I've got new videos coming out here on World of Me. All right, everybody. Well, my name's Cougar. This is the World of Me, another episode of the Amazon review series. I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.